All right, Shalom. Start first by giving all praise and glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Yahweh Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone and Rue Well, and greetings, salutations, and blessings unto the hopeful elect. Shalom unto you. Okay. Um, the brothers to Kwa from the Las Vegas camp. Um, I'm just going to hit a quick script, man. You know, just bring out a news article. I had this a couple of days ago. I believe this was Thursday or yeah, Thursday. And um, you devils are at it again, man. You can't help but allow your tongue to fall upon you and reveal who you are. Okay? It says, uh, this is um, uh, NBC News, U.S. News. It says, Satanic statue erected in the Illinois State Capitol with other holiday decorations. The resin sculpture dubbed a snake tivity depicts a hand holding an apple with a snake wrapped around it. Going back to the Garden of Eden with Eve. Okay. Now let's see the eight related pages. This is what it looks like. The thing that you people don't understand is that snake was a man. Okay. That snake was a man. In, in, in Genesis, the third chapter, that beguiled Eve. It was a, it was a man. It was not a a, a a snake, and it was not even an apple. It was information, the knowledge of good and evil. Okay? It was a tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Okay? Look, everybody got it. And all this is is just showing you, that the, look at this. Goat head satanic in the July in Detroit, Michigan. You devils keep revealing who you are. Okay? You keep showing the world who you are. Okay? I'm going to go to a script. Bear with me. Okay, this is 2 Thessalonians chapter 2. It says, Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come. Hey, when you guys say that the Edomites are done away with, when you say that, um, so-called white man is from Japheth or whatever you try to say without putting this man in his proper place, in his proper order, as the, the, the wicked the Bible speaks of, as the, 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 the adversary of righteousness, okay? The devil, Satan, in the flesh, right? That's who we, this nation of people are, you Edomites. That's who you are, all right? Anytime you say that, you're just lying, man. You're being deceived, okay? This man has deceived you. You look at his track record. This is who he is and what he does, okay? He loves this satanic stuff. You don't see Jay getting deep. You don't see a, a, a large number of our people into that. You look who runs the music industry and this demonic vibration. This is so-called white man. You look at the, the demonic TV. It's so-called white man. You look at the, the church of Satan. It's so-called white man. It's not the East Indian. It's not the the Arab. It's not the uh, um, the Asian. You so called white people, man. You're the ones with the spirit of Satan on you. You have been revealed, okay? It says, "Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come, except there come a falling away first. We fell away. That's why it's working. I were deceived by this damn devil, okay?" Because that we we fell away from the from Yahweh Shai. And that man of sin be revealed the son of perdition. And that's what you do. We see that you love this Satanist madness. We see that you love to kill, you hunt, you you love to go to war. This is you. This is you who opposeth and exalted himself above all that is called the most high God, or that is worshipped, so that he sitteth in the temple. Of God, uh, excuse me. So he that he is, he as God sitteth in the temple of God, showing himself that he is God. Remember ye not when I was yet with you, I told you these things. We knew this. We knew to look out for this man. Okay. The secret counsel, hide me from the secret counsel of the wicked. There's plenty of scriptures. Uh, 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 a uh, nation of a fierce countenance, whose words thou shalt not understand, swift as an eagle, 
and the curses. We're all over the Bible talking about this damn devil. And we're going into captivity under him. Okay? So, and now ye know what withhold it that he might be revealed in his time. Okay? He's being revealed. The mystery of iniquity do already work. We see what this man is doing. The mystery of iniquity. Who's going to be the man? We see who it is doing it. He's the one erecting all these demonic statues. Okay? He's the one putting on all this devil music. He's the one making these Illuminati t-shirts and these uh, pentagram t-shirts and all this demonic vibration. He's the one doing it. He's the one in the Bohemian Grove. He's the one that's of the... Of the, 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 the um, Behind the Georgia Guidestones. He's the one behind... Um, what's that other one? Um, these state capitals, man. All these monuments being put up in honor of, of demonic vibration. They're Baphomet they put up in the front of a state capital. I forgot which one it was. Let me go back. Okay. This man. This is what he does. A nine foot sta satanic statue. Nine foot goat headed satanic statue has provoked a mix a mixed reaction in Detroit. A mixed re that means there's people that like it and people that don't like it. There's people that like it. Okay. Alright. It's not the natural spirit that Jake has on him. Okay. It's ridiculous. We we know and we see who you are. Um This Proverbs three. Yes, Proverbs three and thirty one. Envy not thou the oppressor and choose none of his ways. You gotta separate yourself from this damn devil, man. You gotta separate yourself away from him. Okay? He's he's he has nothing positive for you but an example of what you should not do. And you can watch that from afar off and see. Though he prosper in it, you won't. Okay? He is outside the temple. He cannot uh, do the things that we're meant to do. The Most High God is going to destroy him. Okay? Go to this right quick. Not going to make this long at all, man. Hebrews 12, 16. Uh, Hebrews 12, 16, lest there be any fornicator or profane person. Profane means outside the temple. Outside the temple of what? The Most High God in righteousness. Okay? He does everything contrary to, to, to the, what the Most High commanded His chosen people to do. Okay? As Esau, for who, who for one morsel of meat sold his birthright. And and ye know how the that afterward when he would have been in would have inherited the, the blessing, he was rejected, for he found no place of repentance, though he sought it carefully with tears. He cried about it, man, when he was back with Isaac, he cried. And then he said, Then what you know, the time of mother mourning for my father at hand, but then when I slay my brother Jacob. And pushing out demonic vibration like this. That's exactly what he's doing. Okay? This is exactly what he is doing. This does this isn't just something the statue that's up, it's no big deal. This has an energy and a vibration that goes right along with it. Okay. That energy and that vibration extends out unto you. See, so this holiday season, the Illinois State Capitol is celebrating both Santa and Satan. The same thing. <clears throat> the statue designed and funded by the Satanic Temple of Chicago is on dis display in the State House in Springfield, along with the Christmas tree, nativity scene, and a menorah. 
for Hanukkah, tree for Christmas. Crazy what people do, what people think. Okay, it says the resin sculpture, which the Satanic Temple has dubbed a snake activity, is a twist on nativity. Depicts a hand holding an apple with a snake wrapped around it. The figure rests on the base. It reads, knowledge is the greatest gift. Yeah, because they were the light bearers, man. That's why they call themselves the Illuminati. They were the one that had all the, the, the wisdom. The elites, okay? But now, Most High is giving it to lowly men. We're going to have to take that big thing up out of here. Okay? Meaning, the Most High God is going to destroy America off the face of the planet and all the idols thereof. You know, that's why you see so many uh, wicked, demonic idols going up in the world. You're going to have to take it out. Destroy these places, man. Destroy all the idols. All right. So this is Deuteronomy chapter 12, verse, uh, let me start at verse 1. These are the statutes and the judgments which ye shall observe to do in the land which the Lord power, Yahweh of thy fathers, give it thee to possess it. All the days that ye shall live upon the earth. This is what we were given to the Most High God. This is our wisdom in the sight of the nations. Not to follow after their idols. Okay? Not to be subject to the, the vibration of all these wicked idols. Okay? So ye shall utterly destroy all the places wherein the nations which ye have shall possess serve their gods. Upon the high mountains and upon the hills, under every green tree. When it said that green tree, it always makes me think about the Bohemian Grove. Okay, look it up. This place is, it says, and ye shall overthrow their altars and break their pillars and burn their groves with fire. And you shall hew down the graven images of their powers, of their gods, and destroy the names out of them. Of them out of that place. You shall not do so unto the Lord your power though. Okay. We're going to get rid of all their stuff. Not our own stuff. Alright. <clears throat> Let me get one more script. I'm going to close out. Alright. This is Ezekiel chapter 30. I'm going to start up at verse. Um, 11. He and his people with him. The terrible of the. The nations shall be brought to destroy the land. They shall draw their swords against Egypt and fill the land with the slain. I will make the rivers dry and sell the land into the hand of the wicked, and I will make the land waste. And all that is therein by the hand of strangers, I, the Lord Yahweh, have spoken it. This is going to happen. It says, Thus saith the Lord Power, Yahweh. I will also destroy the idols and will cause their images to cease out of Nof. And there shall be no more a prince of the land of Egypt, and I will put a fear in the land of Egypt. Okay. I will make Pathros desolate, and I will set Zoan on fire. Set fire in Zoan, and will execute judgments in No. And I will pour my fury upon sin, the strength of Egypt, and I will cut off the multitude of no. Yeah. So worship him and no one else in Deuteronomy. I mean, uh, it's like Exodus, the 20th chapter, with the, with the Ten Commandments over there. You know, the two great commandments is even broken. Love, love the Most High with all your heart and soul. You're breaking that because you got idols that, you, that you're putting energy into. So he's going to destroy all these things, man. It's not, not a coincidence. This is the end. It's not a coincidence. All this is so boldly put in front of you. Even in the, the, the internet news, and we read it, and it lines up and everything. Because think about it. Doesn't it make sense that if you're living in a demonic uh, society, that you would have images of your God and your power around? America going to destroy, man. All you wicked-ass people with it, okay? That goes for you two-thirds as well. 
Alright, so with them, we'll close out giving all praise and glory to the Yahweh Bashim Yahshai Bashim Marukakodash. Then we'll the apostles know that great millstone will rule well. Greetings, salutations, and blessings unto the whole elect. I'm going to show the image one more time. <clears throat> See if I can find an image of it. That ain't it. Let's go back. It's like. Show you this image. There you go. Look. What did it say? Knowledge is the greatest gift. See that? Alright. They use this as, as a demonic connection to destroy us, okay? Just summons up their power because they know they have but a short time left. So they're trying to get it all popping 100%. And it needs to come out 100%. So when Yahweh Shai comes back to destroy it, it's destroyed forever. Okay? With that I say, Shalom.